What's up folks? It's me Evanth Windows Fan 1K1. And today, I am going to do a commentary on one commentary on PTBF 2022's Rand on Little Pet Shop. I know this commentary is going to suck because he gave out invalid reasons to his commentary. So let's begin. Hey guys, it's one here, and today I'm going to do a commentary on PTBF 2002's rant on Littlest Pet Shop. And I know this rant is going to suck. Why? Because it gave out invalid reasons to hate that show. But anyways, let's begin the commentary. Littlest Pet Shop, more like Biggest Pet Junkyard. <laughs> Really? Biggest pet junkyard? That doesn't make sense at all. Oh my god, this show sucks. Correction, more like this show rocks. Correction. This show sucks. This show is made by Hasbro. Which is a toy company. What's wrong with it? Anyways, this show involves an idiotic girl and those stupid creatures, and they like to go on failure adventures together. Enough with the failure adventures term, it's getting old and overused nowadays. Blythe Baxter is stupid. That's I am going to fast forward the parts to the end because of the invalid stuff. So screw Littlest Pet Shop, and screw the adventures of Chuck and Friends. No, screw you. Transformers Prime is 67,000 times better than Littlest Pet Shop. What does Transformers Prime have to do with this rant? End of rant. Well guys, I hope you enjoy this commentary. Goodbye guys. Thank god the video is over. Oh, he is a stupid joke for that. There, I calm down. Sorry for raging out loud. So, what do you think about my commentary comment down below? And oh, I forgot that. Everyone, stop unsubscribing me because I need 1000 subscribers. So, bye everyone.